never considered dropping out. Um, I've just had to refocus and uh, and sort of work out that this is you know this is what you wanted to do. I'm not a person to if I'm put my hand up to take something on, I would far prefer to fail and try again than walk away from it. I'm not a person to walk away. Just when you've got an assignment due and you're not getting it or you think you're not getting it and something's happened and you're trying to split yourself in six places and something's due by midnight and you can't lock yourself away for six hours just to get it written. Never. Um, that's never, it wouldn't even cross my mind. Um, there was a point where I considered changing the field of study that I wanted to do but my my heart always comes back to the field of study that I'm in. Um, it's always what I, it's always what I wanted to do. Ah, uh, no, no, no. I'm going to be the first in my family to finish this too. <laughs> um, yeah, definitely. That's just my biggest motivator. Yes, many times. But I felt that I would have given up so much, and sometimes you become so focused that you can't see anything else. No, probably no, probably not. Um, when you're in it, I feel like you gotta gotta get it done. I think with my family I was a bit like clear cut, like I'm dropping out, I've had enough, that's it. But in terms of transition it was easier for me because I knew I knew I was doing the right thing for myself. Um, unfortunately last year I lost my brother. He was he was tragically uh, killed in October and I am um, I was there at his side when he, he, when he left us and it was really difficult to go back. I mean, my brother didn't have a chance to finish off his life. Why should I? I, I didn't think it was right for me to leave my family here when they needed me to go off and see a future of my own. I mean, I could, could go back eventually, but I had my, my family, my mum and my, my boyfriend, they were like, no, Matt, does, wouldn't want that. He wanted you to go to university. He was so proud of me. And I did originally drop out um, after I did complete the very first year and the girl that my best friend who actually convinced me to go to university passed away and I wasn't handling things too well at that particular time um, and I pulled out of university and I didn't go back for um, a three or four years actually. I took a year off so I come to uni I'd done two years had like a massive mental breakdown and then deferred a year and then come back. I just really didn't like working in a crappy job, earning crappy money, like <laughs> I wanted to come back and get a degree so I can have a good job and, and really like succeed financially and succeed in a career and just have that extra personal development. 